everyone, my name is Samantha and this is my vlog, Necessary Nerddom. Today on the vlog, I am going to be talking about getting ready for Comic-Con. Uh, this is my favorite convention of the year, and this is the first time that I get to go for all five days. I'm going Thursday through Sunday, and I'm going to preview night on Wednesday. Um, so there's a lot to get done before I go. I have to get everything done today, so that means we have to get the laundry done, the packing, I've got to finalize um, my cosplays that I'm doing. That's what we're going to be doing today. Okay, so this is embarrassing. This is our pile of laundry. I'm trying really hard to do this all in just one trip. So, I almost have it all. Let me, hang on. All right, I have the laundry. So right now I am finalizing some of the things that I need for one of my cosplays, but this was sort of a new inspiration that just struck me earlier in the week. So I have a lot of pieces that I still need to put together. So right now I am working on my utility belt. Right now I am going to string this pouch because it's going to work great for my costume, but it's also going to double as where I'm going to hold like my money and my ID, my credit card. Really good idea when you're cosplaying at a con because you don't want to lug around more than you need to. If you can find something to integrate into the costume, then you're all set. Alright, so the laundry is done and now I need to start packing. There's a few things that are musts for me when it comes to any con. Number one, I actually got this year and used it at WonderCon and it saved my life. And it is this. This is basically a backup battery that you can plug into your smartphone or tablet. Um, on a smartphone it's going to get you about a charge and a half, but it might just save my life in an emergency. At most cons, everybody's trying to get a signal and nobody can because the lines are all jammed. So your phone is constantly searching, which drains your battery. And next, I always pack one pair of jeans. I am probably not going to need to wear these jeans except for, for one of my cosplays. Also, if you go somewhere nice, maybe at night, uh, like a party or something, jeans might be appropriate. So I always pick a nice dark pair. Uh, next up in the clothing department is a good pair of shorts. Especially for the days that I'm not cosplaying, it can be really hot at Comic-Con. So it's good to have a pair of shorts. These are my favorite because they're not super short, but they're not that sort of strange high water length. As with shorts, a tank top's always a good idea. Obviously, some of your favorite fandom shirts. Show them off. Tell the world who you are. You know, bring your favorite stuff. You'll probably purchase a few more that you'll end up wearing, but it's always good to bring. Plus, I'm going for five days, so I'm going to need something to sleep in. Bathing suit. Bathing suit is a big one for Comic-Con. It's in San Diego, it's going to be really warm, and you are probably going to luck out and get a pool. I think every hotel I've ever stayed at in Comic-Con has a pool. This is Gimli. He wants to play. He's 13 weeks old. He just always wants to play. No. So bathing suit. I will say that I don't spend a ton of time in pools normally at Comic-Con. Normally by the time we make it back to our hotel room, the pools are closed. Although one year we did make it into the hot tub for 15 minutes, which felt great on our tired, aching legs. So you never know. Definitely you want to bring a bathing suit. My Kindle Fire tablet. Again, batteries die, things die. It's always nice to have a backup to your phone. Especially, you know, if I'm going to try to upload a blog or a vlog, which is sometimes hard and doesn't always happen, but it's a good idea to have just in case. Another item that I always bring to Comic-Con is a dress. Just something like a sundress, nice and light and short. Gentlemen, it would definitely be good for you to bring just like a nice shirt. You never know where you're going to end up. There are a lot of really awesome parties you can get into at Comic-Con. I actually think that I'm going to be able to go to a couple more exclusive ones this year, so that's kind of a big deal. So I'm bringing two dresses. I'm bringing this one, just kind of nice and light and very short, easy to wear. And then I also have a yellow one that I just got that's the same thing. Just very sundressy, easy, casual, and it doesn't take up a lot of space, so if you don't end up using it, it doesn't really matter. Do not forget any parts of your cosplay. This is a part that I'm actually still working on because I don't have them all finished, but you don't want to get all the way there and realize that you forgot a really important piece and then go have to buy something else because it's already probably cost you a bit of money. Comfortable shoes. I cannot stress this enough, especially if you're not confined to a cosplay. For the days that I'm not cosplaying, I'm going to have a pair of sneakers and a pair of flip-flops. The sneakers are definitely more supportive, but I'm not going to lie, I'm a flip-flop junkie, so it's hard to get me out of them even if I know that my feet will be happier in something nice and comfy and squishy. Obviously toiletries, cell phone chargers, anything like that you're going to want to bring. I am driving down with my husband and one of our best friends, so I will also be packing my iPad and probably a book, um, although I do books on tape normally when I'm in the car because I get car sick. Uh, lastly, if you're staying at a hotel that this is possible, I strongly recommend 
you bring whatever food you can, whatever beverages you can. It's gonna save you a lot of money when you get down there, even if you just have one meal a day in your room. There are a lot of really cool parties and events that you can get free food in, and I would definitely say look out for those. That's all the tips I have for you for packing. What are your must-haves for any convention, or specifically for Comic-Con? Is there anything that you have to pack? Anything that I'm forgetting to pack? Uh, leave your comments below and let me know what we're forgetting or what you recommend. Please uh, subscribe to my channel, like my video, and share it with your friends. I'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye.